Good morning. Welcome to DDO Wiki Talk with your host Technical Underscore Thirteen, aka Shoemaker. Good morning. Welcome to DDO Wiki Talk. Now, audio is coming through. Let's mute that real quick. How is everybody today? Let's um. Activate our Discord chat so I can hear again if people pop in and say hi. Feel free to pop in a Discord and say hi. It's um, a great way to chat with me live on stream. We also have a DDO Wiki Discord channel. You can ask questions, post ideas, pictures, screenshots, whatever you have. Share what you have. Ask for help. Let's take down the splash screen here. Boom. There it is. PC has been running really hot the last couple days. I'm not sure why. I don't expect it has anything to do with my Discord bots, but... I mean, they're not using that much resources. I might move them to another machine. I don't know yet. How was everybody this morning? Let's take a look at our recent changes. I don't remember last week if I set up a um, a goal 
number of chatters for this week. Or what the prize might have been. I think it might have been a 500 point DDO code for... I want to say 20 chatters. So let's go with that. Pretty sure I got one left. Let me just confirm. Good morning, man. Let me confirm that I have one code left for that. I have at least one code left. Excellent. So, let's see here. Let's bring up... Bring up the application. We'll, we'll go with that. 500 for 20. Just gotta wait for my computer to catch up. Sometimes when I try to do a screen capture, it doesn't like it very much. up good Set this corner where I want it, and then we'll stretch it out. Just like that. Excellent. That looks good. 500 for 20. First two attendees of the morning are going to be M-A-N-D-R-E. Oh, a return viewer. Thought I'd recognize the name. Another return viewer. Excellent. We're going to save this, episode 71. There we go, that's where I want that. So let's see, what's happened in the last week? July 11th. I updated for some new template quest stuff. I did a few quests there. Excellent. So, one, two, three, four. Looks like I got four of them done. And then I hit Litany of the Dead. Um... Maybe we'll work on that today. That, that, that was a huge monster list in Litany of the Dead. And it was all broken and miscombobulated and hard to read and whatnot. Couldn't follow it all. Good morning, Ranger GX. I 
Actually, we're gonna see if we can fix the name for El Pair. That resizable, okay. El Pair has a capital E now. Now when we pull up El Pair, it should be capital E. No, it's not. Heh. I don't know, maybe it needs a restart in order for that to take effect. I don't know that I ever actually finished working on that, but whatever. Alright, so good morning, Nerve. No, 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 no. And Y R V J J N. Let's see what else we have here. Talk. Bulk uploading cosmetic images. No, we don't. Okay, so yeah, we can go over that. That was a, a, a good question to talk about. Um, I did a lot of new category pages for some of the new Update 36 named items. Made some template changes. Let's see here. You can take a look and see what else has been added. So update 36 named items has gotten a huge cut. Take a look at that. Template misspelling, I created that. It's a substitution only template for creating a redirect. Probably mark it as such. Um, template DDO Wiki maintenance categories. We can take a look at that. That's a good thing to look at if you're looking for something to do on Wiki. Template work in progress. Got a little bit of a change. Take a look at that. Template talk monsters and quests. Another support from the forums. We should actually take a look at that. I don't know that we discussed that last week. Green adjusted template developer to not show her as a former intern. Categories are yet watched there that I probably want to remove. Did a consistency pass with the bot to um, make the category something something number items be consistent. Never actually. Well, I finished it to the extent of what I had the code done for. Let's see here, what else do we have? That's about. discussion on my talk page about a naming conflict and how to resolve it and JJ took care of it for me. By creating a disambiguation page, moving the page to monster or moving it to whatever it was, creating a disambiguation page. Good stuff. Reward item and loot pages categories have been updated to use a new template, a good chunk of them. 
Let's see, what else do we have? JJ's been deleting some files, some PNGs, and replacing them with JPEGs. JPEGs tend to be less desired than PNGs. PNGs are clearer, higher, higher quality. So I'm not sure why he's using the duplicate image higher quality. Other than it's possible that the PNG had some extra stuff in it or whatever, or was cropped wrong or whatever, which is what I'm guessing the case is. Welcoming of people. July 15th. Couple more days worth of stuff to go through. And they've been fairly quiet days. Talk graveyard shift. Looking for confirmation on a on something. Change membership for SQRL Monger from none to VAP. It's 58 months old and has 64 edits, which is below the 100 threshold. But combination of it being um, over four years old and popping into Discord and chatting with us um, was good enough for me to do it at 64 instead of 100. All of these categories got trimmed out and replaced with just a simple template that will pull the information automatically. Thirty-six updated Ravens Eye. More specific locations for some stuff by Seahound. Added the new update thirty-six Sharn Syndicate items. Something in. Most of them don't have a lot of stuff to them. I'm actually surprised that there wasn't a, a rune arm with that, considering that they added an orb. Rain's user page got some templating that she then removed in Rebellion and I modified and put back in a different way so that it didn't fill up the page. Still added the categorization that it needed. Status is something Yoko was working on last night. And I think we're up to now. A few more details on the next Nick Repeating Crossbow, which is the item page, which should be showing as I Nick Repeating Crossbow. Hmm. I'll have to look into that. Oh, and template's not working either. I'm not using that. Okay, that's why. I understand it now. I can fix it later. Um, I actually want to inspect this element real quick. So it does still have the item class, good. So, seeing that and knowing that I want to see that these are item pages, and I want to reduce the length of category talk and all of that stuff, I'm actually going to turn on a gadget that we have on Wiki. NS Shortener will shorten visible links to various namespaces to one letter indi indi indications. For example, user becomes U and user talk becomes UT. A lowercase t means talk. So whatever it is, if it's got a lowercase t on the end, it's got it's talk add that to it and head back to recent changes and we should see some changes there. We should see how it works. See the item pages now have the I in front of them and category talk is now capital C lowercase t and as we scroll down you'll see capital T is template and UT for user talk and just the lowercase t for talk. I really like that that gadget. Alright, so let's see here. 
one page of saves. Take a look. Uh, right, Monster West. There's a lot of redundancy and confusion and whatnot that needs to be gone through. That's going to be a project. Let's start at the other end here. So, let's see here. Ravens Talons. Named item sets. Ow. I want to take a look at something real quick. I'm wondering if these are actually in a category for the set. So they should be, I would think. Anger's Wrath items. So yes, they are. So I could actually... automatically populate the item section in here. Oh, but the Gem of Many Facets is going to mess things up. Well, not really, the way that it works. I think I actually want to work on that at some point. I'm going to make myself a mental note, or a not-so-mental note. On Discord. Alright, so a little bit of chat there. Let's see here. And then...
do 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 oh not in here okay that's why Is it? All right, so. Let's see here. Got that note saved in Discord so that I will remember to do it later. In the tech chat channel of the DDO Wiki server. Let's move on, Reaper XP. There are exactly 10 mobs in the short arena fight, excluding potential Reaper spawns. So if you want Reaper XP for running it on Reaper, you need to complete the objective, slay Dryden only after everything else has been killed. That should be on the page itself in some way. <laughs> is that an optional or an objective? It's an objective, isn't it? Let's actually update this page. What's the Discord link? DDO Wiki, DDO Stream. Okay, scroll down. Well, let's do our cleanup.
clean all that up. YouTube video label on YouTube list T Label Actually, we're doing away with this so There should be four monsters altogether was there four monsters there are excellent Take a look at that part first. <clears throat> Excellent. And the links look good. Cool. Um, put it in a browser instead of in Discord.
create a couple of redirects there. There we go. Actually, I'm going to put that on its own line. just to make it stand out a little more. You click on that and you can see where it was added. Excellent talk, Monsters and Quests. So we decided to, um, I went over this last week, I think. Um, back in May, crew asked if we could make the monster table collapse by default, split type and race columns so that column sorting can work, eliminate the text type and race from data rows, and get rid of the width of 90% and just a line left. Um, so I collapsed it, I split the columns, and I eliminated the prefix text. The only thing I didn't do was get rid of the 90% and make it less left aligned. Um, I made it just 100% width anyway. So we talked about all of that. And then, a couple weeks ago, Lord Silver and asked about getting the expand link at the beginning instead of the end or making it expanded by default. So we actually asked about this last week on the stream, and I did, I did manage to get it cross-posted to Fansite News. Should actually take a look at those two threads to see if anything new has been added. I don't believe it has, I've been watching them. And then I spent half a day working on a template for polls so that quest monster table expanded or collapsed by default. If we take a look at this. It's actually just a template called poll. It's in section two on the page. This is the description that shows up. Here in a, in, a, in a description section. And then option one is expanded by default. Option two is it collapsed by default. So you got expanded and collapsed. Those, those are your, your headers. Um, and then support option number one or two. And then index number. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, and what that does is it, you put in the signature and the timestamp 
or a link to the user on the forums and a link to the post that they set it in with a timestamp. So you can see that we got this. These are signatures up here. Um, this was a forum post at this time, and that's actually a link to the post itself. And then it actually even adds a summary section at the bottom that gives a option one expanded by default has an 80% has an 80 percent support and option two collapsed by default has 20%. It will count up how many and do out the math and whatnot and display a percent. So let's see if anybody else has t commented on this. Gerald Marr, we already have that one, okay. And then if we scroll down here, had a discussion about table versus list. And Sea Dog, I believe we already have. It's from 7 Eleven, so there's been no recent updates. So we don't have Sea Dog for some reason. So let's actually add that one. Um, that's going to be a more complex one because I'm pretty sure he has a DDL Wiki account. So that one's going to be support one nine equals user forums C dog. Then we go back to the forum and we take a look here and we mouse over and at the bottom of the page where you can't see it. It actually gives me the member ID number, which is 426659. 426659. And that was a forums post. P equals label equals EDT. Grab the timestamp for the label. Get the post link over here. We can actually delete everything right up to the end here. The template will do the rest. Show preview. Sea dog. Pretty sure that's the right username. It is. He just doesn't have anything on his user page. It's only got 19 edits. Okay, so there's that one. And you can see by adding the one more support, I didn't add anything to the summary. You can see by adding one more support, the summary is actually changed to 81.82% instead of 80, because it's now 9 to 2. Is there any before him? Lord Silverhand we already had. Gargoyle we already had, right? Gargoyle was a collapse by default. Lord Silverhand was the first to support it. If you have an opinion, please um, make sure to comment on the thread.
There you go. There's that. Kind of like that template. It even has a support and option link that'll just actually open up the edit page and take you right to here. Um, I might actually turn that, that link into a, a gadget at some point. But, all right, so template work in progress. What did I do to that? Oh, I added some more verbiage so that if it was on a user talk page or a user page, it won't say this user is a work in progress. It would say this user's sub page is a work in progress. Because um, I thought it was funny that it said on one of my on, on one of the on on a user page it was used on, it said that the user was a work in progress, which you know is probably true, but wasn't quite the correct wording for that. DDO Wiki Maintenance Categories is a maintenance category. There are currently 210 subcategories. So this is a place where you can go to find... Um, hey, Sims2872, welcome to the DDO Wiki Discord. You can spam the heck out of that command. I created one of my one of my bots. I created a command that was restricted to a channel. They can spam it all they want in there. All right. Just checking Discord quick. That's you. Excellent. Let's make sure that you, you're properly marked as a reader. Which you haven't set for yourself yet, but that's okay. I can do it for you. You are now a reader. Excellent. Good morning. Welcome. Let's add you to the giveaway. You never know. You could win, Quasi. It'd be qu you could be Quasi enough to win. I don't know. Sorry. Bad pun. All right. So let's see here. We got our main categories. You can actually sort them. Last touch, subcategories, pages, files. I broke it into three sections there, just so that it's easier to see some things. Um, last, this is when the category itself was last touched. Categories generally don't need to be touched ever once they're created, and whoever was last to touch them. That is just crazy talk. Not like you could win a prize, you know. All right, so we got 441 subpages and 40. Or 441, that's interesting. Dead end pages is showing us subcategories and pages. Oh, subcategories isn't working. Okay, I got that, that wrong. I need to fix that. It's doing a, a, an, an all on that one. I'll have to update that and fix it. But we can fix that one, not a big deal.
But if you wanted to find something to do on Wiki, like categorize pages, there's 329 of them that aren't. You could go through and see if there's anything that fits. Um, help improved, flag for deletion is going to be something for administrators to work on. Um, maintenance category is incorrectly protected. You'll see it's got a different formatting. That's because that one is actually dynamically scaled, where if it gets to a certain height, a certain level, um, it'll show as bigger text in red so that it will stand out more. That way, administrators looking at this page would be more likely to see it. Pages in need of editing. They all need editing, but those are tagged as such for some reason. Requested merges, 13. One stub. Template sandboxes, Wikify, works in progress. That should that generally should be zero. I might make that one a, a red one. Lower number is better for tags for works in progress. This one should always be zero. This these two should always be zero. That one's three currently. I started working on it, but didn't get it finished. Page is using a deprecate, deprecated template. I might want to take a look at that one. Most of these were last touched by the bot on October, or myself on October 5th, 2016 for some reason. Must have done a, a consistency pass on them. The oldest one was February 2nd, for stubs. Sort by name, Cobalt Sneak touched all those, the rest are mine. Alright, so let's take a look at this real quick, see if I can fix that. Deprecated, ah, okay, so it's a sub-template, including itself. Works in progress is one of the ones that should be identified numbers. It should never be that high. Um, currently, it's probably that high because of the hireling pages that I put there. And never finished working on. But let's edit the template for this. Save page. Um... NWP.org slash MW Magic Words. I think it's Magic Words. Oh, Magic Words. And I want... Pages and Category. Pages and category. I want subcats. Pages, files, that should be subcats, not just cats. Excellent. So now if we go back here, See, that's big 169. That's something that needs attention. But now, excellent. Subcategories 210, subcategories 3, pages 118. Good, that fixes all of that. 2 and 8. 169 pages for works in progress. And I'm guessing most of those are hireling pages. And they look like mostly hirelings. I should work on that, um, finishing that template at some point and getting it used. Oh, 
other stuff temporary or why template is being worked on. I got distracted for some reason by it. But that's not a project for today. Template misspelling. No include subs only. Hmm. Let's take a look here. History, recently closed, watch list. Oh, that's not what I want. Works in progress. If I go to substonely templates, oh, I don't have it in there, but it is listed down here, right? Yes. So if I pick one of these templates, I edit it. I just have it set as a category to add. Okay. That's fine for now. I'm going to make a fancier box for that later, but for now, that's fine. Let's take a look at this. Actually, let's... There's a newer edit, so let's look at the entire change list uh, since last week which was the 11th so everything from the 11th onward what's changed in the last week So you can see that there were some notes added at the top. Most of the lists here were replaced with just transclusions of the category page, which is the way that it should be in general. Sharn Syndicate needs to be done the same way. We can do that. And there's some other stuff I want to adjust here. So we don't actually use big. Big is bad. It's deprecated. HTML. And actually,
thinking I want to change the way that that looks to be a quote developer equals Cordovan source equals this quote equals date equals what's the actual quote that is the actual quote okay excellent I'm actually going to comment on that as myself. Be yourself, man. Come on. Come on. There we go.
Oh. Okay. DDO Wiki category game bugs. There. And I'm not even going to preview, I'm just going to send it. through real quick, make sure there's nothing else I'm missing here. Oh, she's not yellow anymore.
right. I think it's just about time to refill our coffee cups. We're going to leave that at that. Come on, catch up. Oh, that's right. <sighs> okay. I forgot to get the timestamp. And I forgot to get the information about my post. So here's the timestamp for this one. Sure that that's going to work. July 17th. There we go. Absolutely. Actually, I want to try something. In the quote template itself. Well, we made it up to 6 out of 20. Let's see here. I want... Sharn Syndicate. Sharn Syndicate Reward Items. That's what it is. Okay. There we go. User forums. Sh 
Shoemaker, and I don't even know what my own ID is. What's my own ID? 381639. 381639. Excellent, looks good. And I'm actually going to open the quote template in edit form if possible. It is excellent. Because I want to see if I can do something. Quote. Place. So that's for bold and italics. So we're going to place, actually, I need to do two for each. So for bold, it's B and I and I And actually, I don't want to do that. Let's start by copying this, and I just want to do it as a single BB code. Show preview. Template BB code, yes.
So I need to see if I can do a regex replace. Um, I don't have the link in here. NWP.org, MediaWiki. Extension string functions or string function. There we go. String functions. Replace. Okay, so I can't do it using that. Oh yeah, we never did go get our coffee, did we? So, So we got bold and italic so far. What other formatting is there? There's color. Mm, I'll start with bold and, and italic. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking about how to deal with that. I'm wondering if... I can actually parse out all of the... the tags. If I parse them out into... I don't know, I'll have to see what I can do. I might have to do something with Explode to um, split the chunk into sections. So section 1, section 2, section 3, section 4, section 5, section 6, section 7, section 8.
refresh this and see if it works. Ah, it does. Excellent. The only other thing I gotta check is to see if quote has a nested option. Or if that's still not something that's gonna work. Well, let's find out if it'll if it will allow nesting. Or if that breaks it. No, nope, that one looks okay. Bulk uploading. Some years ago, a pretty comprehensive set of cosmetic armor images were added to the wiki. Unfortunately, they were added as links to photo buckets, so most of them now appear as upgrade your account to allow linking, outside linking error. But they're still hosted on photo bucket, mostly by a user named Backley2, so I downloaded the entire album, which is surprisingly hard to do, on photo bucket. Now I've got 547 images at about 50 megabytes that I'd like to upload to the wiki, I'm not seeing a bulk upload option, though I bet I'd trip some large trying to upload 500 plus images manually even if I wanted to. Is there a better way? We don't offer a bulk upload option. I checked the page you link, but I don't see any photo bucket errors. And then I did a search and I found them. So it looks like they're all Cricket with a K or Backley. Um... So I tried to look them up on Photobucket and they weren't there anymore. So that apparently changed or for some reason wasn't an option anymore. Um, I was going to set up a script to go through and upload from URL, which you can do. Although we don't have an upload bulk option. I don't think. I think I asked for it at one time, but I don't think it happened. Apparently not listed in here anyway. Ah, there it is. Upload by URL. So you have to be a system operator for that. But we don't have a bulk upload. Another one? Really? Hey, Felina. Thank you for the follow of the DDO stream channel. Okay, so yeah, I was correct. So yeah, 
I don't know if Phasma Thelis will come back or not, but... All right, so let's get our coffee. Ugh. I get so involved in editing things on the wiki that I forget all about other things that I got to do, like eat and drink and sleep. And going to the bathroom is usually not an issue. My body insists upon that, but. Actually, I think I'd rather work on... Good morning, Artie Dragon. Welcome to the show. A-R-T-I-E-D-R-A-G-O-N Save! Yay! Okay, so what was I doing? BB code, that's what I wanted to work on. It's a shame that I can't use regex at all. Regular expressions. Swap out the batteries in my mouse while I'm thinking about it. I use rechargeable lithium ion batteries. Okay.
can't do color yet. I gotta look at the code more. So, four of them. Replace this with this. Place slash that with that. Hey, Medius, welcome to the DDO stream, and thank you for the follow. -up.
Okay, so bold. And one of the italics, kind of, well, no, not really. Bold works. A little bit off on its calculation there. I should go four times. What if I change it to this? Well, that actually works for each iteration. Except that it's repeating the same text over and over and over again instead of just replacing it. So what if I did a... already find source and I throw that in there and then this just becomes var source And then when it's all done, it displays the source. No, we've hit 10 o'clock. Well, that gets rid of that altogether. Oh. Okay. There we go. Ha ha.
So that actually replaces all of that. Now. The ones that have parameters inside, such as color, image, URL, I can't do those using this, the way that it's set up. Um, I'd actually need a regular expression for that. I have no idea what you said. So... I never finished populating. Broken redirects, double redirects are both zero, that's good. Wanted files, oh, I... whatever. Wanted categories is 26, that's a little bit high. Um, uncategorized categories, well, whatever. Ah, in Brazilian, or... Oh, Brazilian, I think, yeah. Portuguese. Yeah, same same thing, right? Alright, so if I pick any post that I can post on and I scroll to the bottom, there should be a link for BB code. Ah, underline. I can do underline. Let's add underline to there. If it's underline, then it's going to be you. And slash you. What else can I add to that? Color, I can't do anything with. Font, I can't do anything with, with the way that it works. Um, indent, not really... List I can do, but it's going to be a lot of extra work. Code I can do. Let's do code. And actually, by doing it this way, I'm actually being overly redundant. B I U code and code should go before I. Code equals code and slash code we'll test these uh, bold italic underline Code, code, code. OK. 
Okay, what else is there? No parse? I can do no parse. Hmm, I should do no parse different. URL I can do, but it might not always work. See, color requires an option, so I can't do that one. Font requires an option. Left, center, and right I could do. Indent I should add, but that's going to take some work. Well, not really. Well, we'll leave it at those for now. Let's see what that looks like. Not working. Code breaks it, actually. Okay, so code will have to be at the end for now, until I change the way that it works. A bold italic and underline will work. So let's see here. Disappear for a second here. I want to bring up AWB so that I can get my... Um, I actually have a code snippet that I can paste in there and it will automatically take care of it for me. This one it won't do because I don't have it set up yet. Category accuracy items. 005... Copy, category, tab, paste, select all, category, save. This one doesn't quite work yet. Because it doesn't know how to deal with this. Construction, it can't do yet. Can do that one. Can't do this one. Actually, I should put this in here for this too.
that one it can do. Let's take a look at AWB, advanced settings. Okay, so let's do this one. That goes there. That goes there. That goes there. That goes there. Skip that one. That goes there. This is a huge... Okay, so that's all of those. Huge template that I made. That when it's done, it will just be intelligence items 18. It knows that it's got a plus sign instead of a and, and no percent sign. I, I, the only ones I haven't done yet are the ones that don't have any per, plus or percent, and the ones that have an extra code like um, armor piercing. Categorize with code. Categorize with code. Good day, Todd. Categorize with code. Come back to that one. Categorize with code. Not bad. I'm actually running a little bit over today. Trying to get some of this stuff done. But since nobody directly follows me, I'm okay with that. Distant diversion. Why is there no results? Oh. Is quality throwing it off? Shouldn't be. I don't know. Somebody say something in Discord. Ah, so the DDO character planner version 4 had a new issue opened. Update 36 planner updates that need to be looked at. Awesome. Okay. Light hammers, category, tab, paste, select all, category, don't watch. Copy, categorize. Category. 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 Let's see here, we have... Todd. We have... Unmitigated. Well, didn't quite make halfway. Quality spell penetration items.
These are the first um, spell penetration items in the game, I guess, with quality spell pen on them. Cool. I'll have to make that later. Or somebody will. Recent changes. Let's do pull up the recent changes and... Got our new categories. We got... Oh, Sunder added some information to Mirror of Glamouring. Damaged items can't be copied. Really? That sounds like a bug because they used to be able to be copied. Ah, repair the item first. So... I'm going to grab the diff here, and I'm actually going to go to their talk page, because I want to... This is, this is why having a user account is important. I would have just reverted that if they hadn't had an account, because I need to ask them a question about it. Page was that item mirror of glimmering? This is why it's important to have an account. And we'll check next week to see if there's a reply. Note that putting this section on his talk page will actually give him a big orange bar of doom at the top of every page he visits until he checks it out. So. Good stuff. Some discussion since we started here on useless info's talk page. 
Battle Engineer. Hi, sorry for ruin ruining your Battle Engineer fun. However, I only updated the article using t text and the release notes. It should be verified in-game. In-game descriptions are likely to be more complete, and I am certain some enhancement en enhancements are now actually obsolete and should be deleted. There's definitely more work to be done there. Good luck. All right. So, since we've run 25 minutes over, half an hour over, we didn't get enough people for our giveaway this week, so let's save that and quit. And quit. And head back over to the homepage. We didn't get enough people, Nerve. Let me get a couple of links for you. There you go. Make sure you check out the playlist. We also have the playlist on Discord. Um, you can go to certain episodes there. Um, check it out. Have a great week, everybody. Catch you later.